Hello, today we are going to be talking about photo merge and how to create a panoramic picture. Uh, it is very easy. I am going to show you the easy steps to make a panoramic picture through Photoshop. Um, so, here we go. I have went to Treasure Island and I've taken a few pictures starting from the leftmost picture all the way to the right. So you can see this is the left picture and using a tripod I took uh, about eight pictures from left all the way to right of beautiful San Francisco. So there you have it, those are the pictures just to show you one more time. Now I've put all these pictures in a folder called San Francisco Panorama. Now I'm going to open up Photoshop. Um, you can do this photo merge using CS3, CS4, CS2. I don't know about CS1, but I'm sure about those last three. So here you go, open up Photoshop, click File, Automate, Photo Merge. Simple as that. And I'm going to use the auto layout, you can use the perspective and all the other options, but we're going to be using auto today. And here you go, these are the pictures I've taken. Simply click browse, chosen, select all, open, and click OK. And here you have it, Photoshop has pretty much, will do everything for you, it'll just merge all the pictures together. It usually takes about 45 seconds to a minute, depending on your speed or, or your computer. Um, but it is pretty fast. It'll select all the parts of different pictures that it wants. It'll crop everything together. And then next, it'll align the layers together. This usually takes a little bit of time, because now Photoshop is aligning all the different parts of the different pictures together. Now finally, Photoshop has chosen all the layers that it wanted, as you can see on the right. And after Photoshop has selected all the layers that it wants, it will align them together again. So I was saying before, different computers take different time. If this is taking way too long, don't punch your computer. Just give it a second and it'll work. And then here you have it. Slowly loading the panoramic of San Francisco. Boom, here you go. This is San Francisco from Treasure Island on panoramic view. Although all the sides are empty, so now we are going to use the crop tool from the toolbar on the left hand side. And I'm going to crop the part that I like from the picture. After I chose the sides that I like. I will right click and crop and here you go beautiful panorama of San Francisco very easy very simple just a three step after I will merge the layers all together to have one picture and to save this as a JPEG file to upload to Facebook or MySpace just click file save as And type whatever you want. For me, it is the San Francisco Panorama. And under Format, click JPEG. Click Save. Now, Photoshop will ask you for the file format. Now, if you'd like to upload to the internet, I would suggest File Format 4. It is small enough to be able to upload to all the websites without an error. 
Um, although if you do want to keep it as top quality, I'll and click on my JPEG picture. There you have it folks, a panorama of San Francisco. Thank you, bye. Thanks for watching, keep in tune, this is Nazar.